What up, Punty? Welcome to Way of Yao. Very natural, right? I know. It has been a minute since I actually sat down and spoke to you guys because recently I've been doing a lot more voiceovers. It's just been easier. I just wanted to sit down with you guys and actually speak. So this is a very quick, 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 quick look. Just showing you guys how to, you know, do something really quick if you're on the go, if you're on the train, on the bus or whatever. All of the products that I use you can literally take with you. All the powders and stuff, like nobody wants to carry around a whole tub of translucent powder. We don't have time for that. So just keep watching this video and I hope you guys enjoy it. And yeah, uh, let's get cracking honey. So of course I've already cleansed my skin beforehand because even though it's a five minute video, you still want to at least like clean your skin a bit you know what i mean i'm going to use a little bit to make sure that the skin is hydrated yes come on melanin get me snatched we are officially moisturized after that i like to go in with a little bit of concealer this is from la girl and this is in the color dark cocoa it's better to go in with something that really matches your skin tone if you're going for a natural look because if you do go for a lighter concealer then the contrast is going to be too much it's not going to look as natural and you're going to need to balance it out with contour and stuff like that so just a little bit of concealer under the eyes just to get rid of the darkness usually for a full-on look i would actually go in with a bit of fawn you know to make sure that i'm highlighted to the gods but this is a very natural look and we're going to keep it that way and now i'm going to blend it out with a little triangular sponge listen these sponges are miracles i literally use it for my reverse contour to set my nose highlight um i use it for basically everything if you watch some of my other videos but for this video i'm just going to be blending this out now and I do like to take that concealer up a bit. Stop here. I'm gonna add a little bit more onto my eyelid area. Concealer up there as well. Blend that into the brow highlight. Just gonna blend up the concealer around my brows as well. Cause we're not gonna be placing any foundation today, guys. So you wanna make sure that this is blended out as much as possible. Perfect, I'm happy with that. Now I'm gonna use my LA Girl Highlight and Contouring Duo. I'm gonna be using the highlight side. I really liked this the other day. I tried it just to set my highlighted area for my a natural look. And it really did the job nicely. You guys know that I usually like using either my Ben Nye or my Laurent Mercier powder or a mixture of the two. But for today, I don't know. We're going to switch it up. And of course, I'm just dragging that out. It's going to give me more of that snatched, cunty sort of appearance. And I'm not using this part of the sponge. I'm using this side of the sponge instead. That was really good. You can literally just flip it over and use the other part. Look at, listen, we looking snatched and we ain't even snatched, honey. Just to set the concealer up here a little bit. Cool, I'm happy with that. <laughs> I look so weird. I'm gonna add a little bit to my moustache area because it looks a little bit off. Now I'm gonna use some of my NYX foundation powder in the color Deep Dark. I'm just gonna use this to basically go over all the places that we didn't put any concealer. This is just really to help mattify the rest of the skin. For this video, I really wanted to use products that you can literally just take with you on the go. Cause this is literally like something you could do on the train just to spice up your look a little bit. So you don't look too dry. Literally just dusting that over my skin a bit and so I use products that you can literally just take with you because you don't really want to take a whole jar of Laurent Mercier now and be putting that on your face on the train that's not really gonna work now is it so literally you could just take this little thing here dust some foundation on you can put a little concealer on with a little sponge just dusting this over 
the concealed area as well just to make sure that it is all blended nicely this is literally like five minutes like yeah girl I'm happy with that like we are looking like slightly snatched if you wanted to you could add a little bit of blush I mean I'm not a blush kind of person you know but I have used blush in the past but not really anymore but yeah you could add a little bit of blush just to spice it up a bit you can highlight a little bit you could do whatever you want to do I'm literally going to add a tiny bit of my highlight here a little bit on the cheekbones just the tiniest bit just give it a little bit of a glow tiny bit on the nose bridge that is the look <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video it was literally just a quick one just to you know give you guys something a little bit more subtle a little more wearable you know because I know sometimes we are struggling to get to work or get to wherever we need to go and we need to have a little bit of something on so this is the look basically something really quick hope you enjoyed it and I will catch you in the next one uh, bye guys uh,